What's up, homies? I want to show you guys some of the rhyolites I found the other day. This one I accidentally left in the car, but it wasn't as nice as I thought it was going to be. You could see the uh, porosity, and yeah, that's common in rhyolite. It's hard to find pieces that either don't have holes or have the holes silicated. And what I mean by that is this rock is actually silicated. You can see there's a layer of silica. And that's from steam depositing the minerals into the cracks. This is actually a quartz line right here, which is the same thing as this. It's just a broken face. This is actually nicer material. And I had the same feeling like my other friend when he found a piece of rhyolite that looked like petrified wood. This actually looks a lot like opalized wood, but opalized wood would uh, be shinier. Yeah. Opalized wood looks a lot like this. And the only difference between opalized wood and petrified wood is opalized wood has a water content. So sometimes this silica will fill in the bubbles and you'll have some finer material, but this is a reject piece. If you tried to cut at it, it would probably break apart because it's kind of fractury too. If you study it closely. Um, I really like the pattern. That's why I wanted to use it. I wanted to cut at it. Even though it is silicated enough, see how it's silicated enough, but it has holes. Too many fractures. Yardstone. 